sit here wondering, do I fit in? Is there something else I could have been? Martin McAllister, local businessman and future multi-millionaire. Tenants have a right to privacy, you know. I'm sorry? And anyway, what about all these repairs that needs doing? It's your job to get them sorted. Is that right? And then might you be? Sir, it's all right. I don't know what these two have been telling you, but they were given notice to leave two months ago. So that's what I am. I've got a bar. I can, I can prove it. Just hold on. Well, we've had plenty of coppers poking around here, and you don't look or sound like any of us. Hey! Percy Miles, where is he? He's in recess. But you have to report to reception. Yeah, don't worry, I'll get it sorted. Why has this been reversed? Uh, well, the fellow was very happy with it, so he's done it again. Oh, what? Look at all this. Look, Brad, you worry too much, right? It's a building site. Is she all right? Yeah, she is. She's a lucky little kid. What's she doing out there? We don't know. We're still questioning her. She wrote down her name on the name of the hotel, and that's how we located you. The bird tells me he was having a sniff out of bins. You find what you was looking for? Well, you're going to have to wait to find out, aren't you? Well, I suppose I am, aren't I? I'll get someone. Yeah, yeah, you do that, old timer. Shoes, jewellery, underwear, very select. So many pairs of silk stockings. Fine as silk. I need the best for Mr. Courtney, Mum. Yeah, but these bills do need settling. Right. Follow me. Excuse me, can I help you? Hey, hey you, stop that. Oh, hey, hey, what the hell are you doing? Hey, hey, stop that. Oh, of course, oh, security. Oh, stay away. Who are you? He's coming in to die, and we're going to let him. What's your problem here? You stay where you are. What's brought this on, and how do you know this patient? I don't suppose he's told you why he's trying to kill himself. He said what you've been doing to my daughter. How would you like to die? Empty the safe. Well, I don't want to hear sorry, do I? I want a decent curry, that's what I want. I mean, you do understand English, don't get eh? Speak the English. How's everything going? No, it's all sorted, don't worry. Good. How are you getting on with the pitch for Nick's refurb? Oh, I haven't had a moment. Well, you do know he's got a shortlist of other architects, haven't you? He hasn't. Yeah, yeah. Oh. There's been a type of full and frank discussion yesterday, so perhaps the message didn't get through. Well, you keep your nose out and oh. stay away from Jamie Wood. Uh, one other thing. Would you mind? Yeah, it's uh, Queenie. Much obliged. Pleasure. Well, now your deposit won't be returned because of the state you left the flat in. Well, then I suggest you read your tenancy agreements all there in black and white. The same to you, mate. Empty the till. There's an epileptic on your forecourt. Oh, no, that's Peter. He's uh, trying to get parts. Mm. Remind me not to break down at this garage. What's in the car? So it's in a steering wheel. What do you know about gypsies? No, they're not to be trusted. All right, get your dog. On your way. I mean, they were the best. But they were caught completely unawares. Stay in the car. Peter, what are you doing? He wants to die and I'm seeing he does. Pete, you can't, you can't. Don't you dare start defending him. Don't you dare. No, but Pete, you can't do this. You do. I have to do it. Do you think he is ever going to get anywhere near the kids again? Again? He's been doing it for two years while I was away and you did nothing. Of course, I was scared. I'm not frightened to admit that. That's OK. I was telling Sandy we make sure the girls are protected at all times. Look, sorry to have to break this up, but I've got a couple of things I need to get sorted. Do you want to wait in the car? I'll have a quick word with Dave. OK. So I guess you'll be in touch then? Sooner than you think. Don't worry, I'm going. And I'll see you both in court. I'll get the best lawyer money can buy. Check or cash either will do, Martin. You won't get a penny out of me, you old fool. Hmm. Look here. Love Louise. Give me that back. Came out a picture of your victim. Now, I call that sick. I didn't kill her. No, 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 of course not, no. But you've got no evidence to back up your case, have you? Just like poor Jamie. For a funeral day, innit? You sure this is the right frequency? Positive. Get that bastard! Oh, they got everything they deserved. They won't try that again, will they? I know! I can't well feel I reckon I was pretty convincing by anyone's standard. Cheers. Nice one.